Hello Twin Flames and welcome to your DM to the F reading for Saturday. My name's Liz and this is Guided by Angels. And I'm going to bring in the powerful masculine mind today by our soul sister Tammy from Bloom and Arrow. What do the masculines want to say to you today? What do they want you to know on this powerful 1111 portal? And I definitely feel so much power and movement ahead as we move into this new moon energy. And you may even be feeling that power today with the 1111. So what do the masculines want to say to you today? And if you would like a personal reading with me, I am available right now. You can email me at guidedbyangelsxo at gmail.com. So we've got three cards coming out and one card moving on top of the deck here. So the masculines are saying to you, planning. Now, I'm definitely feeling they're in this planning phase. Especially with this 11-11 energy and the energy of the new moon. They want to meet up with you. They want to make plans with you. They want to sort things out. They want to take their action. And I know you'll be feeling that too. He's saying, I'm making plans for us. I know you're waiting for me to take action. And I'm planning out how to do that. So if you're thinking, is he going to reach out? Yes, he is. If you're thinking, when's he going to reach out? It's going to be soon. But you have to be flexible and adaptable to the when and be at peace with the when and focus on you. And then you don't start stressing out or worrying about it or wondering how, when, looking at your watch, getting impatient. You are in the flow of this journey. And it's so important right now that we move into the flow of this journey, especially because we've all been experiencing stomach issues. So if things have felt stuck or stagnant, you're being asked to be more in the flow because your masculine is very well aware of what he needs to do. And they're giving me slime from the mouth, which is also about craving that change because he's saying, I know that you're waiting for me. I know you want to take action towards me, but I know that I need to make that first move. So if you've been feeling that way, families, and I know not all of you have been feeling the need to reach out or you know, that, that, that want to, but if you've been connecting with that, that's because your masculine is intending to reach out and you've been feeling that pull. So the angels are asking you to pause, wait, delay, because they are going to reach out to you. They are just planning right now how to do it. I'm planning how to do this. I'm planning when to do this because it needs to be the right time. Yeah, look at this. It needs to be the right time. I need to take my time making this decision. It's too important. I need to take my time coming forward towards you because it's too important. It's too important and I don't want to mess it up. So I need to do it the right way when I feel calm and energized and in alignment with you so we don't fall out again. So we don't trigger each other again or hurt each other again. So we can smile and laugh and be in joy and have a good time together. I feel like I only have this one chance to get it right with you. So they're very aware that they've messed it up before, that they've pushed you away before, that they've taken their time. And they know that it's time to take action. I know it's time for me to take action. I know it's time for me to prove to you that you're the one that I want. I know it's time for me to show you how I feel is genuine. And this love is real. But I need to take my time with the planning so I don't mess it up. Because I feel like if I mess it up again, there's not going to be another chance. And that scares him. So he's saying, let me prove to you. Let me come forward to you. Let me have this chance to get it right with you. Because there's only you. I know I'm in good hands with you, Divine Feminine. You love me the right way. You give to me the right way. You love me and give to me in all the right ways. I don't get that anywhere else. I don't get that from my friends, my family, my karmic partner. I don't get that anywhere else. Only you. There's only you. I know that you can give me the world, but I also want to return it to you. So let me do this my way and my time for my reasons. And it will be the best thing for us both. So let go of any frustration today about when's he going to reach out? How is he going to reach out? Is he going to reach out? Because you know deep down that he will. He's just waiting for the right time. And if you've seen foxes, foxes are a sign of that planning phase, that solution coming in, the way being made. If you've seen the stag, you've been reminded of the promise of your union and that the masculine is changing and transforming the right way to be with you the right way. 
If you've seen bees, that's a symbol of the miracle ahead, the communication. And any other signs that you see are showing you to have faith and trust and have faith in the journey to trust your masculine to do it their way. He knows he's in good hands with you. He knows you love him. He knows you love him the right way. He knows that no one else can give that to him. He can't get that anywhere else. He's just feeling a bit lost right now and he needs to know that you're there. So this is the energy I was connecting with at the start of the week. Send that masculine love. Send your masculine love right now. Send that love out through your heart chakra. Connect with them through telepathy. Connect with them through meditation. Breathe. Because he's saying it's so dark here without your light. So he's well aware that without you it's dark. It doesn't feel very nice. It's not warm. It's cold. Because you're like the sunlight. You brighten his day. You brighten everything up. You lead him home. It's so dark here without you. I need to feel you. I need to hear you. I'm lost without you. I need to connect with you. So he's not going to stay away for much longer because he's missing your light. He's missing your warmth. He's missing the way you feel. He's missing your healing energy. He's missing you completely. And he knows what he wants and he wants you. So he's saying to you, let me do this my way. I'm planning right now how to move forward towards you. I'm planning right now how to make it right. I'm planning how I can make it up to you and show you how I truly feel. And I need to hear you right now in the darkness. So I feel that's really you reaching out in a spiritual way. You know, you may feel guided to reach out. And obviously, there's no right or wrong on this journey. Always do what feels good and right to you. So if you feel you want to reach out to your twin, there's nothing stopping you from doing that. But if you feel it might trigger you if they don't reply or you don't receive a response, then wait a bit longer. Because he's going to reach out to you. He's already planning how to do it. He knows you're waiting for him to take action. He just needs to work out how to do it. And that takes a little bit of time. Because he wants to do it the right way. And he also needs to take his time with any decisions. If he needs to walk away from a karmic partner, he intends to do that. If he needs to end his job, he intends to do that. If he needs to tell you exactly how he feels and what's on his mind, he intends to do that. If he needs to make changes in his life or speak out to his family or his friends, he knows he needs to do that. But he needs to take his time with the decision to do it the right way. He's saying it's too important. It's too important. I want to be with you the right way. And I feel the masculines are also taking their time so they don't go into that feeling of regret or guilt or pain or shame where they can go backwards because he knows that when he makes the decision, when he comes up with the plan, when he's given the solution, he's going to act on it straight away. And that's so true. You know, when the masculines make up their mind and when they have a clear plan in place, they act on it. And it always happens very quickly and very spontaneously. So the best guidance for you, Divine Feminine, is be ready for anything, but also be in the flow of anything, be in the flow of life. Do you enjoy your day. Maybe you're already starting to plan for the holidays right now or you're getting excited about something you've got coming up or work on that, work on your projects, your goals, your dreams, update your vision board, connect with this energy of the new moon and set your intentions and ask for what you desire and give it the time it needs. And if you feel frustrated, if you're checking your phone, if you're getting stressed out, put your phone in another room, watch a film, Netflix and chill. Go and have a hot chocolate at your favourite coffee shop. Go for a walk. Have a nice relaxing candlelit bath. Go shopping. Go out with your girlfriends. Go and watch a film at the cinema. Do something that takes you out of that moment and into a fresh one. Because then you're going to feel energised and excited because you're connecting with your inner child. You're doing things you enjoy. You're reconnecting with friends, family, loved ones. And you're taking your emphasis off you and your twin or your twin in their situation, or what they need to do. And that gives them that time to make the change without pressure or stress or worry or struggle around you waiting around. Because they'll feel it energetically if you're busy doing you and loving life and feeling strong and powerful. There's nothing more sexy than when the divine feminine is in that energy. And there's nothing more attractive to the masculine than you in that power. So work on that today. 
focus on you. Maybe you've got extra hours at work with the holidays coming up or you want to put some extra time in at work. Or if you're self-employed, maybe you want to work on a new goal or a new project or a new dream. And those are the things that are going to heat everything up and work everything out. Because your mask and is planning on reaching out to you, does want to make plans to meet up with you, but just needs to take a little bit of time with how to do it so he doesn't mess it up. I hope this helps. Have a great day and I'll see you soon.